In Zambia, there are many offenses that one could commit which are against the laws of the land. For example, possession of marijuana, wearing clothing similar to police or military personnel, wildlife trophy hunting, or even defaming the president. But now, apparently, even one owning documents to their own land and property has been added to this list of illegalities. This is the case of Nobo Mumbi, who has documentation to property, yet it is only for show. Mumbi is proprietor of Mupangawa Copper Mines Limited, situated in Mumba district of Central Province. In 2011, Mumbi was issued with a mining license by the Ministry of Mines and Mineral Development under Mupangawa Copper Mines Limited, and the following year, 2012, a pegging certificate. Possessing all documentation and machinery necessary, Mumbi began mining on his land but stopped after a short period of time. However, in 2018, he received a shocking call informing him that there were trespassers mining on his land. After going on site to see what exactly was going on, Mumbi was only shown an exploration license issued to Pentagon Resources Limited and that their prospecting area is the same one already given to Mupangawa Copper Mines Limited. I reported them to the police. Uh, the police said when we came to them here, they, they just asked them if they had anything. Then they, they showed them a, a prospect, a large scale uh, exploration license. But to my surprise, the police seemed so reluctant to act. Mumbi named certain individuals as masterminds of the confusion. I met one who introduced himself as Mwaka Kalebo. He's the, the son to the former IG, Darius Kalebo. So I believe because of the connection he has with the police, it's, it, it seems like this Kalebo can't be arrested by the police. And then there is a Frankie Mulenga Chimpusa, whom I've never met. It's just the police that have been mentioning his name. And the same Kale was mentioned his name. But I know to say, one fact I know, one fact I know, the police are benefiting, senior police officers are benefiting from this project. And one police officer informed me, a junior officer, in confidence to say, boss, we would have acted, but the, the commissioner of Central Province is interested in the project. He has complained through many legal channels, yet he has not received any help at all. When police moved or failed to act, I went to complain to the permanent secretary, the late Mr. Murenga, may he so rest in peace. He took up the matter and referred it to a, police, a senior police officer at a force headquarters, a Mr. Kabole or Kabonde, something like that. I went to see that Mr. That police officer, senior police officer, his rank, because the, the central police uh, province commission is involved, his rank couldn't allow him basically to act. So I, I was advised to write to the IG. I wrote to the IG and I took the letter, I cc'd the copy to the, to the Home Affairs Minister, Mr. Kampion. I took the letters myself dumped them and left there and uh, gave the secretaries to the IG. When given an opportunity to respond, the Ministry of Mines only advised Mumbi to go through the channels of appeal. This is despite the fact that the ministry itself is an active party to this illegality. I'm left with no option but to just wonder the sort of country we have where you can have legal documents that can never be respected by the police that can never be respected by any law enforcement officer. Because it's not only me that is losing. There's a revenue that is going because these people are stealing and they don't pay tax. Virginia Chilongo, Movie TV News, Mumbwa, Central Province.